going on people back at it again with another amazing video today guys i'm going to talk about an application that many have heard of the name before and some haven't now this is called unlock my ttv the reason why it has ttv is because this is a terrarium tv clone okay basically it's identical and everything works pretty well and it's really nice and smooth okay the other one is just called um unlock my tv and that is a cinema hd clone okay now both of these apps or this app in particular is an ad free version okay so let's get into it and i'll show you how it looks and you probably already know how it looks because like i said it's a clone so let's get into it and then i'll show you on the back end how to get this app so this is the ttv see this is also the newest versions the two uh, 2019 as you see here the name was changed and you can change to the, any player you want let me just back out of that use the uh, update and here you just hit thanks for um the, to go into it and here you go it starts off with tv shows as you can see and you can go up to little upside down triangle you get your categories okay and you can click over to the search uh, magnifying glass. You can search a show, or you can click this um, weird upside down triangle thing. Um, you have different years you could choose from, okay? So just to show you guys how this works, let's go into Stranger Things for TV shows. We'll go into it, give it a second, click down. We're gonna go into seasons. And oh, just to show you guys too, you see this star, you're gonna click that to fill it in. So now it's this show is saved into my favorites, okay? So you go into, let's say the new season. You click that, this will pop up, just hit okay. And that shouldn't come up no more. That's just saying if you press the play button on your remote and the links come up that you'll start the stream. So let's go season three, we're gonna choose, I don't know, episode five. And from here you could press play on your remote and it should pull up links for you. Once again, you can read that, hit thanks. Give it a second here to pull links. And once these links pop up, obviously it's gonna have the best ones on the top and the poor versions on the bottom of this list. Now, usually I give this time to actually load up. Um, I usually give it about 30 seconds or sometimes even longer just to pull up a good amount of links. Now, you go here now let me just tell you guys some of these links are not hundred percent working well so if you click a link and it's buffering or it doesn't stream really well just back out of it and choose a different link okay so we're gonna go off with the first one we're gonna click that yeah see it's still uploading so that's why you see that there so we're gonna hit stop and there you go you see you get better streams so like I said, just patience is a virtue because you'll get some really good streams. So let's try this again. There you go, you hit play, and it should pop up right away, okay? Well, not right away, give it some time to um, get it situated, and there you go. So we back out of that. As you see, it comes up and it works pretty well. So now you're like, okay, that's awesome, but I wanna know I want to know about movies so what you do with the movies is you go to the triangle or the hamburger then you see how you got TV shows and movies so you go to movies and there you go you have your most popular you start off okay once again you hit that triangle you're gonna see you have your in theaters and all these good different categories you can go into new HD and as you see it pulls up or you could go to in theaters and as you see there so let's say for example I don't know let's just go spider-man um, you click it obviously you're gonna hit okay okay you can click that right there that actually is the play button but we're gonna actually back out of that and we're going to play the Press play on our remote. It's going to pull the links up. Give it a second. It will pull up links. 
I honestly think this is still a camera version. It doesn't have like a true HD version yet, so you may get camera links. Um, yeah, it pulls up some links here. Just give it a second here to load up. And like I said, it will take some time depending on how fast is your internet and what type of Fire Stick are you using. Now, if you're using a, um, a first generation Fire Stick, it is really slow. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. The second generation gets better, but the best one is the third generation Fire Sticks if you're using a Fire Stick. Well, actually, this actually looks like it's in 720. So let's see how this is. We click that, we're gonna hit play, and let's just check this out. Give it a second. Give it a uh, load up time. Uh, no, it's gonna back out. As you see, I blurred it out, but as you see, it's not pure HD. It's just a 720 camera version. It's, you know, it kind of sucks. But anyways, there you go. As you see, it works. And now remember guys, if you wanna save this movie for later, just hit that little star, fill that up, go over here to the back button, go to the hamburger you see there, click down into favorites, and you got your TV shows, and then you get your movies, okay? Now you back out, and now you're like, what about the settings? No problem, go to settings, and you see you have here, you can change your app language into Spanish and all that, you can change your player, you can show only HD links. You can filter out camera view, um, camera version links. Okay. Um, let me see here. There's a lot of stuff here, but I'll be honest with you. I wouldn't mess with too many um, settings because then next thing you know, you kind of screw with the settings and it won't work properly. But it's really self-explanatory here. Um, you see here. Um, one thing I'll be honest with you guys. You see this right here? You can click that. And it will take away that little weird bar thing when you're trying to stream it, okay? Or stream a video. So, there you go. Back out of this. It's pretty much, my opinion, as close as it can get to uh, Terrarium TV. So, it's called Unlock My TT TTV 2019, the newest version. Now, your question is like, well, that's cool and all, JoJo, but how can you find this? How can we get this? All right. Let me see here. I'm, I made it simple for you guys. Get file link. Okay. Don't have file link. Link is down below how to get it, how to use it. It's really easy. But if you do have file link, just click that um, file link once you open it. And you're going to enter in my um, my channel store code, which is 645-39676. Click continue. And then you're going to see the store come up. Okay. Right now it's in the testing area, but it's right there. Unlock my TTV 2019. And you just basically click the download button, allow it to download. Once it downloads, you're gonna see it go into that screen. And then from there you hit the button where the play is and you're gonna hit install. Once it installs, it's gonna say done and open and pretty much you're, you're good to go, okay? Back out of this. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Guys, enjoyed this video. Please hit the like, subscribe, and share button. Also, check me out on Facebook, Telegram, and Twitter. All that information is down below. How to get into it, how we could communicate. Also, check out my website, which is Jojo's Amazing Videos.com. Um, I sell a great um, IPT, IPTV service for a very low cost, and you get pretty much good channels. And customer service is far better than a lot of services okay so hope you guys enjoyed this video please once again hit the like button and hope you guys enjoyed have a great evening